Most of us that have to go out and drive in those conditions yeah. are glad. I know the kids are probably, you know, my own kids <laughs> included, are not happy that they didn't get to make snowballs and have snowmen. But mm -hmm. I'll tell you, it's not even actually winter yet, so we got to ease our way in. Yes, this. I'm sure we'll get there. We will. I'm <laughs> sure we will. It says starting off to be a bit of a busy start to the winter season, but you can see this storm, really the worst of it, missed us just to the northeast, not far to the northeast. If you have travels that take you up tomorrow, especially into North Jersey, some spots got over nine or ten inches of snow. No tree branches are coming down now that the winds are picking up up there and it is a mess. So expect some major slowdowns up that way. Things will be a little better in our neck of the woods. Here's a look outside right now. We'll take you up to Bethlehem and you can see the road still looking a little shiny. It's been kind of raining and snowing on and off all day long. And even though it didn't amount to much of anything, the roads are still wet. Temperatures are dropping. Now the winds are picking up, so that will help dry out the roads a little bit. But keep in mind, anytime tonight or tomorrow morning you're out and about and you see what looks like shiny, wet conditions on the roads, expect that it may be ice. Black ice, very, very dangerous. It can come up on you quickly. All you need is a little patch of it, and it can send a car's tire spinning. It's usually easier to drive in snow, certainly, than it is in black ice. So please be safe out there overnight and into tomorrow morning. Even though it won't be widespread, it can be very dangerous. And again, you can see still some snow showers. In fact, now we're starting to see a band pop up in our western suburbs, areas that got virtually nothing all day today, now seeing at least a little light snow. Lancaster County, Chester County, down into northern Delaware, seeing a mix of snow and rain. We've got a couple of bands here. You can see one area just that's just moved east of Trenton. And as we push down south, this band right here sitting and dumping some snow, possibly even some accumulations possible here over portions of Burlington and southern Ocean counties through the next hour or so. Winter weather alerts still in effect for parts of the area. These mainly go until about 1 a.m. It includes a winter weather advisory for Ocean County, Burlington, Bucks County, Northampton County, and Carbon County in the Poconos. Monroe County in the Poconos is still under a winter storm warning, as is all of North Jersey for the most part and southern and eastern New York State. Overnight will drop down to 30 degrees. There are still scattered snow showers around. And keep in mind, because temperatures are above freezing right now, the roads will likely just be wet. But eventually, we're going to drop down to below freezing, and that could lead to the ice formation on the area roads tonight. Tomorrow is mostly sunny, windy, and cold. 41 degrees will be the daytime high. It will feel much colder than that. Our wind chill tracker was showing temperatures feeling like the mid-30s all day long, even with highs in the 40s. So you will need to bundle up tomorrow as that storm departs. Winds come in around the back edge of it. But tomorrow is a full day of sunshine, 5 p.m. looking good. I'll be down in Rittenhouse Square for the annual tree lighting. We'll bring that to you live. Should be a nice, albeit chilly night for that. Make sure you bundle up if you're heading out. Wednesday, we'll see some clouds and possibly a few scattered sprinkles or flurries in the afternoon. But that's about all we've got as far as snow or rain in the forecast for the rest of the week. So a quiet but cold pattern sets up. 41 degrees tomorrow, windy and cold. Wednesday, a stray flurry in the afternoon, otherwise mostly cloudy. We'll see sunshine Thursday and Friday, but temperatures still below average in the low to mid 40s. And we'll keep it dry and sunny through the weekend. 40 on Saturday, a little bit milder Sunday at 47, and we may be back to the low 50s by early next week. So no more mm. snow really in the forecast, but you are going to need those winter coats and hats and gloves for the rest of the week. Okay, thank mm -hmm. you so much, Kate. Appreciate that.